All right, big guy, come over here. Oh, shit. Get a bone to pick with you. Holy crap. <laughs> what is up, everybody? There's a rock game in here. And at long last, it's finally here. It's time for the Elden Ring Shadows of Erdtree DLC. Oh man, I've been excited for this for so long. And also I get to finally show off this build, which is I like to call the Virgil build. If you don't know who Virgil is, it's he's from the Devil May Cry franchise. I'm so excited to show him off right now. And before I do that, I just want to let everyone know that this is not a mod build. This is all made in house. I just wanted to say that. So without further ado, let's do the epic for real in three, two, one. Look at this guy. As you can tell, he's a magic user. I mean, come on. How could I not? I wish I can zoom in a little bit closer. Yeah, this is how he looks. And I can't take full credit for how Virgil looks. Face was made by Creative Creations Channel, who made the Virgil face that you're seeing today. And honestly, I gotta give my hats out to this channel because goddamn you put a lot of detail in to making this character if you're curious to see what other creations he has i'll leave a link in the description i mean goddamn i still can't stop praising him because oh my god he has so much build faces for those role players out there like what i'm doing right now with virgil so yeah that he gets this channel gets all the credit for the virgil face and as for the loadout we have today, we have, of course, the Glintstone Moon Staff, as well as another Uchikat or a Moon Blade Katana, just because why the hell not? And in the opposite hand, we have Millennia's Blade, and we have another Moon Bell, just for that double Moon Blade sword. And just I know they're nerfed as all hell because of the latest patch, but screw it, I'm still going to give it a try. And as for the third one, we have the Banish Sword, Great Sword, and because it almost looks like it's the Force Edge. And also I get to do this. Yeah. How could I not be a Virgil build without him going whoosh 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 whoosh. And of course, same thing with Melania's Blade, Waterfowl Dance, that just screams Virgil. And of course, the move in is a no-brainer. Still sucks that it's a nerf, but oh well. I'm still gonna run with it. And now we have to the most controversial part of this build, probably. You're one of those soul players that stop at level 150 or 170. Get ready to go, oh my god, this guy cringe at his level. Because here we go. Yep, that's my level 260 and holding a lot of souls just because, I don't know, I just feel like 260 was a good amount. And as for the souls, I'm just gonna. Just keep hoarding and try not to lose them. That's what I was trying to do with this. And as you can see, my vigor is up, mind, endurance, dexterity is a little roof, strength, beast, uh, is the minimum for the banished knight greatsword, intelligence, of course, because it's also a magic, Virgil's a magic build. And we have the blue silver mail armor, it's the scale gauntlets, just so that way Virgil can look like he has his Beowulf set going on we have the rotten wings or insignia brave mass talisman 
Shard of Alexander, and Earth Tree's favor plus two. And we just got these for equipment. As for the op and for the ghost, of course, it's gonna be the mimic. Because you know, doppelganger. But yeah, that is my Virgil build. And so, let's move on to the DLC, shall we? Well, hello. Who are you? Huh. Were you guided here by kindly Mikula? I am Letta. And like you, I was guided by Faith along his honorable path. Touch the withered arm, and you too will be transported to the realm of shadow where Mikula the Kind now dwells. My compatriots are there already. Like us, they have heard kindly Mikula's call. If you can find them, they are certain to lend you aid. Oh, is that right? Come now. Touch the withered arm and travel to the realm of shadow. I will not be far behind. May we meet again. Come now. Touch the I will not okay. be Okay. Okay. Just making sure. Alright, here we go. We've been waiting for this moment. Touch the hand. Let's go. Okay, so this is just new game plus plus. Or just new game plus two. Okay, good to know. I completely forgot. Before we enter the DLC, I should let you guys know that at the last minute, my friend who I've known for a long time and I consider him like a little bro. He got his hands on Shadow of Nerd Tree, so this is going to be a co-op gameplay. Ooh, this should be interesting. And yes, he is just as much as a Souls fan as me, so we can take our punches. And hopefully we try not to bitch too much. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to have a co-op Let's Play this time around. And so, our story begins. There you are. Okay. You ready? <laughs> oh, yeah. That is beautiful. And I see our first boss over there. I want the one with the fields. Yep. Way over there. <laughs> Holy shit, this is cool.
All right, big guy, come over here. Oh, <laughs> shit. Get a bone to pick with you. Holy crap. I didn't even do anything to see that. Hold on, hold on. It did some damage. Oh no. Oh wow. Well, we can't take that on yet. No. Nope. <laughs> well, we died. Time to review bomb this DLC just like everyone else. <laughs> but those that re review bomb this, they have somewhat weight to them. Because this DLC is definitely the hardest out of all the Souls DLC combined. Normally, it's supposed to only take like, you need to be maxed out on your gear and after that you're Gucci. But here, you gotta do some tomfoolery. As well as probably co-op or use everything to your advantage just to score a W. Yeah. So this is Mikula's Halo Tree, right? Yeah. So it's in a different time. Yeah. Or a different re reality. It seems like it's a different reality. Yeah. Because this tree is like growing. And it's pitch black, unlike the one in the lands between. Let's try over here. Oh yeah, that's how you run. Okay. Damn, it's been so long since I played. Anything interesting? Ooh, what do we got? Dead merchant. Lump of flesh, classic. Mm -hmm. What the hell? <gasps> oh, wait. burning dog, that. Missing stone three. Oh, missing stone four. Hmm, not bad. What's over here? Ooh, we got a big guy. Church of Constellation. Holy crap! Holy crap! Hold up! Hold up! Oh wow! Black steel, great hammer. <laughs> Fragment? Hmm. It's a new level of power. Yup. Black fire. What? Ooh, what's this? Guys friendly? Of course not. Holy crap! <gasps> mm. 
Man, they hit hard in this DLC. <laughs> Love it. This is like in game. <laughs> yep. In <-game> DLC. <laughs> yeah. Hello? Fire coil. Oh, hello. Did it. Mushroom. What do we have here? Blessing of the Korea? Huh. I forgot in this one I went for madness. <laughs> That's why my guy is like orange. I think. Try jumping. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing chest ahead. <laughs> if you jump. Jump path ahead. Hmm. Do gem, do gem. Oh. So are we down there? No, that's a different one. Oh, there's more than one giant, huh? Holy shit. <laughs> this map is huge. <laughs> Love it. We got a lot more people to bonk. Yep. <laughs> so I probably won't be able to play until later tonight. Earlier tomorrow night. Okay. We're gonna probably play with some tomorrow. Ah. What the hell? What the fuck was that? I wonder if there was an enemy because my health bar didn't show up. Oh shit, there's a beast claw dude. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh crap, come here, come here, come here. We got invaded. This is no invader, this is a MP, how was it? Hey, hey, hey. A DLC character. Oh shit, this is scaring me. Take that, take that, take that, take that, take that. Yeah, how do you like them apples? Wanna try again? Holy shit. Beast claws, nice. Well, I'm gonna need your help kicking ass on him. <laughs> yep. It's a good thing I was looking around, otherwise, I would have just got my ass beat down by <laughs> I almost did. <laughs> Ooh, why is this part red? So is this, 
if this is in a different realm, but this is behind uh, that root tree. Oh, I didn't know that was a dragon until now. Oh shit, that is a dragon. Damn. <sighs> There's another one down there too. Uh, burning dude. Oh yeah. Just standing there menacingly. Ah, uh, something incredible. Yes. Oh shit. Oh shit, get ready. Where are you? I know in this game in Mikula they hide they hunt the tarnished. Okay. As it was... Maybe it was just a bird. Yeah. What's up there? Where? Look over here. Something's on top of that thing. Ooh, in those buildings over there? Oh, wait. Oh, I see what you see there. <gasps> That's the thing that's the weirdo that follows me to the bonfire. Holy shit. <laughs> Love this DLC. <laughs> There's a map over here. Map. Oh, oh yeah, the map fr fragments. I forgot about those. Okay, so. Holy shit. It's a lot more. Ooh, is there anything on these trees? Oh, 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 I know what they're referencing here. Um, uh, it's a manga called Berserk. There's a, there's a panel on there that shows hanging people on the tree, corpses hanging on the tree. The inspiration for Dark the Dark Souls games. There, that's cool. Let's try what's up in these over here. <gasps> I see shiny. <We'll> get greedy. <laughs> Half crack pot. This game has told <laughs> I mean, I could stay awake. So it give you wings? Kind of. <laughs> oh Ooh, a cookbook recipe. Wait on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, sit right here for now. I'm gonna go take Stinky Old back to uh, just uh, the spawn room. Alright. While he's doing that, let's take a moment to reflect on what we've experienced so far. Badass enemies, cool new toys, and the Berserk references are still here. Yeah. I'm starting to love this DLC even more than before. This way. Visible dog. <laughs>
Oh yeah, I forgot we have lanterns. <gasps> Shadow Realm Ruin. The heck? Oh, look through that. Shiny. Oh crap, do I need torrent for this? Oh, I don't think so. Hey! Think a remedy. Good to know. Ooh, entrance. What's down here? Oh, okay, we're just when it circles that way. Okay. Ooh, a door. Open sesame. <gasps> A chest. Blade of Mercy. Ooh. A new talisman. Raise attack power after each critical hit. There you go. I see shiny. Uh, yep. Mushroom? Yep, mushroom. Why is it always mushroom? It's a sign. Let's clear this place out. <laughs> you will try to miss the giant again. <laughs> We're not gonna win when the stomps on the fire. <laughs> yep. At least we have a ruin or a grace over here that we can just spawn back to. Heal up. Hmm? Better heal up. Let's try this again. Hello. So is it like the legs? Yeah, it's the legs. It spreads fire. Oh crap! Hey, at least I got some damage. Let's go to the shit. Oh, come in. Oh, shit. I'm out of tears. Just keep running. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> what the hell is this thing? Oh, 
Ah, oh no! <laughs> oh crap! Oh! <laughs> oh shit! Did I bring it down? No. He's mad. He's mad. He's mad. Oh. Holy shit, that's got a wide, wide area of effect. Damn, bro. <laughs> Just one pimp slap. Oh no! 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 Let me check this part out. Okay. Oh, there's that bird. Oh, it's gonna attack me. It's a death like bird. Not. There's another one over there. Smithy what, 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 what's that? What's that blue hue over there? <gasps> They're enemies. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Themselves. Okay. Anything over here? Steak America. Ooh. <gasps> 
Listen. Ooh, looks like a boss fight. Oh, just to be on the safe side. What do we have here? Black Gold Knight. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a cannon. Oh no, no, you don't. I got him. Good, he's out of juice. Holy shit, that was a tough guy. Oh yeah, I got a work. Holy shit, I got this whole armor set. Damn. Oh yeah, I forgot you poof. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Damn, I need 27 strength to wield his sword. great sword. And that was day one of Elden Ring Shadow of Nurtery. And oh boy, we just only scratch. The very bottom of this huge ass mountain of an iceberg that we're trying to climb. Oh boy. And we still got plenty more adventures to go. And I also want to thank La Waffle, or as he's called on Instagram, that Robin. And yes, his Instagram will be linked in the description if you want to check out what he's up to. And also tell him. Tell him that there's a rock gaming sent ya. <laughs> but yeah, this was so far a very good fun time. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for when the next DLC episode comes out. And man, this next round is definitely gonna be more intense and stressful, as you'll see. Until next time, this is Desert Rock Gaming saying goodbye and have a great day.